Okay, this is a review of the Bose Soundlink Color. Uh, it is a very full sound that comes from this uh, rather small Bose speaker. Uh, it's not, my hands are not that big and uh, it's actually quite small for the amount of sound that it puts out. I work in a very uh, noisy environment and um, most speakers, most stereos i found where you have to turn the volume up loud enough to be able to hear something it becomes irritating to the ears, but with this Bose speaker, it's a very full, uh, very pleasant, loud uh, sound coming from it, and it's not irritating to the ears, and it's quite a pleasure to listen to. On the top here, you find the controls. This is the on button. Connected to Galaxy Grand Prime. And it just notated there uh, that it's connected to my cell phone so that I can listen to... Uh, whatever audio I would like to hear. Uh, stop button there. If you listen to a YouTube video, you can actually stop it in your phone by hitting that uh, pause and replay button, volume up and down, and uh, auxiliary is in the event you wanted to actually plug your headphone jack into the speaker itself, and you can plug that in, into the back there, that lower port there. Uh, the top one is actually the power port. That's one of the things I don't like about this. You can see how it sticks out. It protrudes in this direction, perpendicular to the speakers, such that uh, it, unless you actually have it standing up while it's charging or being plugged in, uh, you could end up putting pressure upon that uh, when turning it you know, any other direction, sideways, for instance. And uh, I didn't really like that kind of design on the plug there. I sort of wish they had it... Uh, lined in some other direction, perhaps top to bottom instead of front uh, front to back. Uh, so I don't really like that orientation of the power plug. Uh, most rechargeable batteries, this contains a battery that uh, you cannot replace. Um, it's stated that you can get 300 full recharges or full cycles out of, out of the battery. Uh, so far, I've had this for a little over two months and I calculate possibly up to 50 uh, cycles on the battery and at this point I'm only getting four hours of use out of it before uh, before it does die, four, four and a half hours and it was originally rated at eight hours so I'm a little disappointed in uh, uh, the battery uh, capacity at this point. Um, the top indicator here will turn red really can't see it here. Connected see, it's sort of green, Grand Prime. or it'll turn amber, but it, when it turns red, that means the battery's getting low. Uh, once it does turn red, I find you get about another 20 minutes out of it, and then it just shuts itself off completely. Um, overall, I do like the speaker. As I said, I'm a little disappointed in its capacity from eight hours to four, or four and a half hours, only after just a couple of months of use. Although I will say, uh, when they give you this here power cord to plug in the USB port they say don't use it uh, on anything other than a wall outlet and I have used it uh, in other alternative sources of USB power and I wonder if that could have affected the battery and I also wonder a little bit if exposing it to somewhat higher levels of heat uh, just because of my work environment could have affected the battery as well so it's a little difficult to tell but on balance and overall it's uh, a wonderful speaker beautiful sound and um, I've been pretty happy with it.